What's going on, Quarter Snipers? Hey, I'm excited to be here today. This is your boy, Carlos Estrada, with the Quitted Assassins team. Guys, we are excited to actually bring this to you today, man. This is an amazing day. We just came back from a conference. We were at the, the Growth Con with the Grand Cardone and so many amazing people, guys. You don't even know how much our lives and minds and others been affected just because of the quality of people that was in the room and how we were able to network. Guys, you want to get somewhere, you need to be in the place, you need to be in the room that where you want to go. That's the only time that your mind is going to expand. But I look, man, I just want to throw some gems at you guys today. And one of the main things I want to come and bring to you is, guys, how do you get to the 800 Club for free with no money? It is going to take some work, though. It is going to take some work, but it takes discipline, guys. Consistency is the mother of all. Everything that you do consistent, you become great, not good. You become great at, and nobody can take that from you. Before you do anything in life, any investments that you should do should be on yourself. You by yourself are the gem of this world. This You are the person that is going to take you and your family to the future to create what we call generational wealth. But guys, let me stop preaching to you and let me start continuing talking about more, more about credit. So how do you get to the 800 Club with no money? All right, you guys want to know? Well, let me tell you guys. But before I continue, please, if this is your first time on my channel, make sure that you go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Click on that bell icon. Make sure that you click on all so like that you'll be notified every time that I post a new content. And guys, I'm coming to you every single day, seven days out of the week. We're talking about between one to four times. I'm excited to put content out. I'm excited to research. This is more than a hobby. This is a passion. I want to help you. And I found out that by helping you, I help myself and I'm able to create this community. So I appreciate you guys that follow me, that I want, that you guys engage with each other. Keep bringing all that knowledge. Some of you have some good, good gems, good stuff that help other out. And sometimes I'll learn from you guys too. So guys, I don't claim to know everything, but I'm claiming to actually do the research and I will always work any person that comes around. But guys, but before, before we continue too, please give me the thumbs up. Let me know that you love this content like that. YouTube will pick up the algorithm and push this content to a lot more people so like that they could benefit as well. Thank you guys. All right guys, so let's talk how you can definitely get to the 800 Club with no money. Now this should not be a secret and I'm so passionate about it because I don't know why we don't learn this in school. I know that you didn't learn it in school. I didn't learn it in school. I went through even two masters and I wanna learn how to even be able to get my increase off or be able to increase my credit lines or be able to start a business or be able to actually get credit funding for a business to scale up or even for myself to be able to better my ability. They just teach you that pay your bills, do all this. Guys, there's so many hacks that you could do so fast in order for you to increase for free. But guys, it takes, it takes some discipline. This is what I need you to learn. What you can do in order to get to where you are right now and get to the 800 Club. And it's gonna take some time. It is not, it doesn't happen overnight. It's something that you gotta keep in mind is that your file and somebody else's could be completely different. You both have been through diff different situations in life. It's like your DNA, your fingerprint, and this is your business or your credit fingerprint. It is completely different than the other person to your left and to your right. But the first thing that we can do, guys, is, you know what, your payment history. Payment history is about 70, oh, I'm sorry, 35% of your whole credit, the credit score. And by doing this, guys, if you ever get a late payment, it will affect your credit score. And I'll tell you what, tell you why is that and how I know so so good. Not only I see it on on on, our, on a lot of our clients, but it happened to me too. Now I'm telling you everything that 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 I learned. Now I was able to learn how to remove these late payments from my credit report, but that affected me big time. One late payment brought me down almost 80 points, guys. Now think about this. Let's just say that you have three credit cards. Each let's let's start by one. One credit card that has for that you have for at least three years. So if you had about three years, that's 36 months, right? And you have a late payment. So now you have 35 good months and uh, um, one month that you were late. That alone now 
brings you to the 97 98 percent on time payments that if you go to credit card it tells you that that's horrible anything below 98 is not perfect and it will affect your ability to get lending now if you get more credit now let's just say that you have three cards at the same time you got them at the same time three years ago 36 now you multiply this times three which will be a hundred and eight if my math is correct yes 108 so if you have one late payment then your you know your uh, on time payments will be 107 and you have one late payment which will affect you so much less so this is why i tell a lot of people do not be afraid to know first how to apply for the credit card knowing where they pull for, or the credit pulls from knowing what credit credit score is required and knowing all and about how much you'll get with that credit bureau or that credit um that credit um that credit <laughs> that creditor so guys if you want to know this it's a free gift from us to you go on the bottom of this video it's going to be called the remaster secrets lenders list that document right there is a research that we did it's going to tell you at least where every creditor or every lender pulls or what bureau will pull from and what is the required credit score for you to get lending now imagine that you know how to do that and imagine that you have the plan of attack before you attack that that pretty much guarantees you're winning right so do it it is free it's our gift to you guys no strings attached just make sure you get it now guys 35 percent is your payment history so please 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 make sure that you at least put your bills on auto pay or whatever you have to do in order to help yourself guys don't have any late payments now if you do we could teach you how to get those off like i said we know how to do it because this blueprint was made and was built for me not from anybody else but I decided to actually show people how to do and how to tailor that blueprint to yourself. Now, the second part will be credit utilization. Now, a lot of people will tell you, no, credit utilization should be between 30, 20 to 30 percent. You know what? Yes and no. Um, if you go to Spirit, you go to Credit Karma, you're going to get different type of information. But the, something that I found out to be true is when you stay between the range of two to five percent now how do you do this i mean if you have a lot of bills good get more credit get more credit we can teach you how to remove those inquiries we have something called the 72 hour inquiry deletion it will allow you and will show you how to get those removed now get more credit for example if you have twenty thousand dollars of credit use of fifteen thousand dollars and you apply for a ten thousand dollar credit car and you get approved now you went from 20 to 30 so instead of you being to a 75 percent credit utilization because you were at 20 thousand adding the ten thousand dollars will bring you down to a 50 percent which is not great but it's so much better than being at a 75 percent so get the new credit guys get the new credit don't be afraid get the credit just be responsible learn learn how to manage your credit and how to be able to pay everything on time now another thing that you need to think about is 10 percent is your credit mix or the top of, uh, of accounts that you have do you have revolving accounts or do you have installment accounts well guess what you need to have both why is that it creates or builds the stability on your credit file how strong it is and anytime that you go to be lendable they want to see that they want to see that you are an all-around individual and not just I have one credit card can I get a car no more than likely it won't happen this is why most of the time when you never had a vehicle before and all you have was credit cards they require you to have a co-signer because they, they don't trust you they don't you just just your credit file is not that strong so guess what you need to have somebody back you up just in case you decide to run off they're coming after that person so think about that start doing whatever you can do today in order to start creating a well-rounded type of file that creates the strength of your credit file in order to in order for you to be lendable and fundable now another thing is your increase guys or the new credit anytime so we talked about getting new credit yes you need to get new credit that affects 10 percent of that but anytime you get a new credit card it diminishes or decreases the age of your credit file but this is when we come in this is where we show you the hacks and the tricks on how to remove those credit the, the, those credit inquiries 
but at the same time we show you how you can add trade lines in order to increase your age thus not affecting you as much just at the beginning but you could definitely go ahead and balance that out in order for you to start creating a strong credit file now guys last thing is the age of the history of your credit file which usually in, entails 10 percent of your whole credit score now the age remember what i said to you anytime that you get new credit it diminishes your age so for example let's just say you have one credit card and all you have was one credit card in your life and you had it for 10 years you pay on time so your credit score is good but it's not strong it's good but it's not strong so you have a credit card for 10 years and today you say i oh, mean i love that chase sapphire credit card i'm gonna apply for it because it has some good perks whatever the case is you apply you get qualified guess what your credit age just went from 10 years to five years why is that because your age was 10 now and you only have one credit card now if you add the second credit card you need to take those 10 years and divide them by two and that becomes five that's the way age works but as you say that you're getting low and low and low what you could do is add a train line or become an authorized user on somebody else's account or, or, or credit card that has a good age that age will be added to your to your credit file and again now we'll be dividing that like that is how you can start increasing the the age of your credit report so guys these are five little things that if you're doing consistently if you stick with it if you take the discipline if you learn how to do it you become great at it and you become a sniper at credit and that's what i want you to be i want you to become a credit and sniper now guys we can help you we have created what's called the best credit blueprint and we'll teach you all of this more in detail credit is one of those things that this is just the tip of the iceberg and this is just the little things that you can start doing but there's so much more that you can do to remove pretty much everything everything out there anything that you believe that is absolutely erroneous and it shouldn't be in your credit report whatever you believe that's what that's the power that you have in order to remove from the credit bureaus so guys hey i appreciate you guys who are here today i'm so excited about this one and i'm so excited about what i could bring to you and what we coming out with stay tuned businesses we are about to bring something so revolutionary that is going to drop your jaw your job nothing else straight job all right no but serious guys it is going to revolutionize kind of dwarf anything and everything that you've seen out there it is going to help you to become fundable between 150 points but hey you know what i'll leave that for another video this is just a teaser we're definitely going to be coming out in the next couple of weeks and putting more and more info so that, that you know and you can definitely benefit from this guys thank you for your time my name is carlo estrada I am the Credit Assassin. I love that you guys were here today. Make sure that you subscribe. Make sure that you click on that bell icon and click on all so that you'll be notified every time that we post a new content. But overall, give me the thumbs up. That is going to help me tremendously to take this content to more and more people. Guys, I'll see you in the next video.